the Grateful Dead have released a line of vegan deodorant. What do you suppose a true, dye-her deadhead smells like? Sweat, beer, pachali or maybe way too much weed. How about rose, lavender and juniper? In collaboration with North Coast Organics, the Grateful Dead have launched a line of deodorant, yes deodorant. It might seem off-brand, but for the rock legends who were long labeled as hippies, a vegan line of deodorant is kind of fitting. With the band's iconic thunderbolt on the packaging, the deodorant comes in five different scents, skull and roses, lavender, rose, sunshine, blood orange, bergamot, working mints, cedarwood, juniper, timber, Douglas fir, sage, and unscented. All are handmade in small batches, using 100% natural, vegan, edible ingredients, according to a news release. I have been a deadhead since 1999, North Coast Organic CEO Nathan Morin said in a statement. The music and spirit of the Grateful Dead have influenced my company's core principles of service, veganism, and organic agriculture. The Grateful Dead have inspired us to stay true to our main mission of social responsibility. We took care in creating special oil blends that reference the Grateful Dead's music, Morin said. The Grateful Dead, which was formed in 1965 in San Francisco, was inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame in 1994. After the death of lead guitarist and vocalist Jerry Garcia, however, it disbanded. The remaining members of the band have done individual and reunion concerts since then. In 2015, the surviving band members reunited for a series concerts called Fare Thee Well, celebrating 50 years of the Grateful Dead. The band's legacy manager and archivist David Lemayuek said the line of deodorant aligns with the deadhead's love of the world around us. North Coast Organics lives and functions as we do, with an awareness that the future's here, we are it, and we need to take care of the planet and ourselves, Lemayuek said. Click subscribe to receive the latest news.